Hey everyone, welcome back to Cliff Tips. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you won't miss any of our future videos. Today, we're diving into the world of SEO and I'm going to show you how to use Google Keyword Planner for beginners. So, let's get started. Google Keyword Planner is a free tool offered by Google Ads. It's primarily used for building new search network campaigns, but it can also be a very useful tool for SEO. It allows you to research keywords and see how a list of keywords might perform. To access Google Keyword Planner, you'll first need a Google Ads account. Once you're logged in, click on the Tools and Settings icon at the left side of your screen, then under Planning, select Keyword Planner. Now, you'll see two different tools, Discover New Keywords and Get Search Volume and Forecasts. If you're looking to find new keywords, click on Discover New Keywords. You can start with keywords related to your business or product, or you can start with a website URL related to your business. Let's say we're searching for a coffee shop in New York. We might enter keywords like coffee shop, best coffee shop in New York, organic coffee, and so on. After entering your keywords, we are going to change the location to New York which is our target location then click save. After that click the you get results button. If you find out how to do keyword research for your YouTube videos, just click on the link above or in the description. Let's go back to our topic. Now, you'll see a list of keywords along with information about average monthly searches, competition level, and more. This data can help you decide which keywords to use in your SEO strategy. If you may be asked, how to get this data? After you've got your results, you might want to download or export this data for further analysis. To do this, just follow these steps. 1. Choose if you want to download all the keywords by relevance, just check the checkbox next to it. If you've selected specific keywords and only want to download simply check each box. 2. Above the statistics table, click the download icon. 3. You'll then see a drop down to choose a file format. You can choose between CSV and Google Sheets. 4. Just click one that suits your need. If you choose Google Sheets, a pop up window will appear. You can then rename your file in this window before clicking Downloads and it will automatically download and save to your computer. And there we have it. We've successfully downloaded our keyword data and imported it directly into Google Sheets. Now, we have a comprehensive list of keywords at our fingertips, ready for deeper analysis. We can sort and filter these keywords, track their performance over time, and even use this data to identify new SEO opportunities. This is the power of Google Keyword Planner, it not only helps us discover new keywords but also enables us to analyze them effectively. So go ahead, dive into this data, and let it guide your SEO strategy. That's it for today's tutorial on how to use Google Keyword Planner and download keyword data. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and share it with anyone who might benefit from it. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more tutorials like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.